What's up, nerdlings? What up, nerdlings? Do you nerd for... <gasps> mail and mail. Mail and mail. Hey, nerdlings. It's Jasmine from Nerdy Blade and Cosplays, and you're watching Do You Nerd? Mail and mail. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. That's right, nerdlings. We have some more mail and mail in the Weston household. Now, this was something that I kind of knew was on its way, but I don't really know what's in here. He never tells me anything. I, I don't. I, <laughs> I keep secrets from her so that she could be surprised. This is from fellow YouTuber Zombie JLT. Let me tell you a little something about Zombie JLT. You have never found somebody that is more supportive, especially in all of the streams. I feel like every time I'm in somebody's live stream, <laughs> they're zombie always there always on social media got your back all the time and the gaming beautician showing you how to keep those games and everything else so clean which means we may just have to ask if uh they want to show their kits sometime some of you might have seen my restoration pics on twitter and i've gotten a lot of support and a lot of really positive feedback well i was actually thinking like isn't that kind of the way zombies are? They're like, they're just always there. Oh, they're always I there, never, they're always lurking. They're always like, you turn a corner and boom, there's a zombie. I boom, there's a zombie. All right, well, let's pop into this box. And when this video is over, make sure you hit those links in that description and check out all the stuff that zombies do. This, uh, this box looks like it went through a, a zombie horde. So hopefully everything's here. Two boxes in one box. Two boxes in one box. Just some uh, wrapping in there otherwise. No bubble wrap. Sorry. <laughs> but... <laughs> one is for me and one is for you. Do you know how I know that? How do you know that? Because there are notes on them. Like the one that says... It says, Lacey, my lady chamomile. And mine is Tom, my lord, Chamomile. So, if you guys have not been following, <laughs> we got to review an awesome board game, Epic Monster Tea Party. So much fun. And not only is it fun, but the king and queen bear a striking resemblance to a, uh, a couple of nerds that you just happen to be watching right now. First and foremost, I love the I am very impressed box. with this box. Look at this. This is like professionally printed and everything. Yeah, it is. I Jeez. love this. Your, Your supernatural <laughs> gamer. And gaming beautician. Me first? Yes, ma'am. Alrighty. Well, there's a fun thing on the inside of the box. Oh, there's zombie JLT right there. He's going to eat my brain. Probably. Watch out. There's candy. Uh, oh, um, glorious candy. Did you see what kind of Skittles oh, these are? Oh, there's zombie Skittles. That is oh, so cute. No. That's adorable. Most taste delicious, but some taste like rotten zombie. <gasps> Dare to try. But we have to, you know we do. I've never tried these before. Have you had the high chews? You know, they sound familiar, but maybe I've just seen them. They uh, got mango and kiwi. Yeah, they got good flavors, at least. All right, well, let's see what's in this one. I can already see what's in here. <laughs> I can see, too. <laughs> Sweet. Yes. It is a rogue bobblehead pop figure. I do not have a rogue. I'm surprised I yeah, don't have a rogue. I, I didn't think you had any rogue pops. So cool. <laughs> and I would just like to note that this is obviously the rogue that we're more familiar with. The good rogue. The green and yellow. She's got the belt. She's got the jacket and, you know, the hairstyle the way it is. Now, Rogue has had a lot of different looks over the years, but this one has always been the most iconic to yeah, me. Yeah, that's the best one. Well, her, uh, her bobblehead's a little top heavy. Well, bobblehead uh -oh. is top heavy. This ain't Cajun country, hun. Zip those lips. Ho, ho, ho. Holy crap. This looks like Spider Gwenum. And I didn't know this was out or that there was one of these. First of all, it's it's fun that it's a bobblehead, but 
the Look. detail on the tiny little body. Whoa, that is incredible. See, look, it's the top of the mouth and bottom of the mouth. Yeah, I, I definitely see that. So, and then see the rest of the mouth, the tongue is coming out that is of the leg. That is weird. Oh my gosh, I am so excited to read this line. I haven't, I haven't got to look into it very much yet, but I've been seeing all the toys and everything for it, and I didn't know there was a Funko for it out. That is super cool. We have a flying oh, rogue. Oh, that's cool. How neat is that? A flying rogue bobblehead. You know, I actually like the stands that have, uh, you know, the character suspended uh -huh. like that. That is always fun. And again, the, the rogue style that I think we tend to lean more towards. Yes. Little piece of advice, Cajun. Never make that woman mad at you. And here, just for... Oh, that was a good one. And then, like I said, inside the box is zombie. And then hashtag keep the gamer faith. Hashtag gamers helping gamers. And hashtag gamers supporting gamers. Those are fantastic hashtags. <laughs> this is a hashtags. great box. I love um, this. It's good you quality. Got some, you got some cool stuff, but I'm, I'm excited to see what's in mine now. Oh, double zombie! So I got some treats too. Did you? We got lots of high shoes. Ooh. Oh no, I got zombie skittles ha, ha. too. We're both gonna have to. Oh no. We're both gonna have to do it. I'm I'm nervous about the ones that taste like rotten zombie. What is a rotten zombie? Ta oh wait, we got mints one time. Do you remember? Long ago. Long long zombie time ago. Mints. <laughs> They're brain flavored. I bet they are. Smell. God, I do not want to try this. They're little mints. Just nobody ever wants more than one. And I can see one. Not the worst thing I've ever had in my mouth, but that's a lot worse than I meant to do. And they were supposed to taste like, or be brain flavored. Yeah, they were just more like, kind of like a, like a smoky weird flavor. Wait, I don't you can't know. smoke brains? How else would you prepare them? I guess, them? I don't know. It's just weird. I don't know whatever happened to those. What'd you get? What'd you get? Oh, Gambit! Nice! nice. Oh, sweet. This is perfect to go with Rogue. I know. Oh, good. And he's got a stand. He's got a bobblehead. Again, Gambit is one of those characters who he's had a few different styles throughout the years. Uh, probably not as many as Rogue. No. But... I like the iconic trench coat over the uh, the black and pink, purple, depending on who you got coloring it. But that weird face helmet thing that he wore too. It always looks so cool in comics, but I tell you what, you ever see someone in real life wearing one of those? It's, yeah, it's like kind of his weird. ears sticking out and it's like, what, what was it supposed to do? That is so cool. And he's kind of got like a metallic sheen on his yeah, boots Yeah, he does a little bit, yeah. Gambit and Rogue were always my favorite characters, which was so awesome that it when that when we got together and found out it was your favorite character too. <laughs> nice, I like awesome. the card one. I have a toy. I have a oh Marvel Legends gosh. figure that has a toy where the cards are being flung out like that, and I love that option. I like how it look. It's in, in, like encompassing his whole hand. Yes, that that's is a, a nice that's detail. A really cool detail. So touch. it's it's like he has a hand, and then they just put it yeah, over they put, it. So that they like molded over it. And kind of the same with the cards too. I always liked when he would do that. He would take his cards and the two fingers and flick them. Just boom. that one's probably my favorite so far. You know that you got. My Spider Gwen's my favorite. It's it's pretty cool too. Whenever the Funko figures have like an action pose like yeah. that too, because like Funko figures are cool enough. Whenever you no, know, they're they're just like in the standard pose, but they, despite the simplicity, look like who they're supposed yeah. to. Yeah. But yeah, now that they're doing like more of the action poses and stuff, I love that. I do like how the card is inside the plastic here. I mean, it's they're double sided too. Yeah. See how they're really yeah, going all out. They're really doing impressive work. Whoa. What on earth? Is this just like a mixture of like all kinds of Spider-Man? Oh, okay. I'm going to have no, to look into in this. There. I'm not quite sure about the, 
like the white and black suit. Yeah, that is now, see, interesting. You're my go-to with well, spider stuff. I know. Well, I'm just starting to delve into the spider verse. That is really neat. Future Tom, if you've got any information, we would love that on the screen right now. Again, you have one of those great stands that have him suspended in the air. Mm -hmm. So he's leaping. And yeah, the bits of uh, Venom coming off like his knee yeah, and everything. Yeah, I always like that. And any Venom toy that they do, they always have, you know, like it literally still looks like the symbiote is alive on the toy. That is very, very cool. Man. That is just, pretty cool. Boom. Supercharge the Funko Pop collection. Sorry, but I, got, I, I think I got the coolest one, though. That may be up for debate. Look how the details, you know, you got the teeth up here and then you've got big mouth on her thigh and a tongue and and she's Spider Gwen. I mean, that makes her <laughs> the best anyway. Well, how about we try one of these Skittles? I'm not scared. Well, right. it smells fruity. I don't think that they smell like zombies. No, it smells fruity. All right, I'm going to start with the green one. So don't let me down, green. So it does have some flavors listed. Chilling black cherry, boogeyman blackberry, petrifying citrus punch, mummified melon, and blood red berry. I'm pretty sure I got the mummified melon. It is pretty good. I like melon flavored things anyway. <laughs> so I'm cool with that one. And I'm glad it wasn't zombie flavored. I'm gonna try whatever color that is. You get this. <laughs> I was scared. I think it's a berry. Probably the red, blood red berry. That's very good. Not bad. All right, well, we'll have to keep this going and see which one of us gets the zombie <laughs> first. However, would you guys believe that zombie is not done with us yet? Hey, what? Yeah. Because there's another package here <clears throat> just for you. Me? Why just me? He gave me a package. What's this? Well, I need a knife. That's not a knife. That's a box cutter. All right, all right, you win. Yeah, well, that's all we got. <laughs> that citrus punch is good. <laughs> That's a zombie. You got a zombie <laughs> I one? I got a zombie. So what does rotten zombie taste like? Like a smoky, meaty, kind of like, I don't know, like a peanut. You know, like kind of like the aftertaste of peanuts. <laughs> it's not gross. It's just different. Well, there we go. The zombie apocalypse. You Here. can eat the zombies. Try this blue one, because I ate a blue one. Oh. Oh. See, I don't think it was that bad. <laughs> Ooh. I obviously eat weird stuff. <laughs> of course, I have, you know, sinus allergies, which causes my taste buds to be dulled a little bit. <laughs> That's gross. It started off all meaty, and then it was all tangy. <laughs> Maybe. Oh. Well, yours did have an extra piece attached to it. I give you extra zombie brains. <laughs> oh. That just ruined the skills for me. <laughs> Ghost poop. Please don't dump that everywhere. I still don't know what it is. I still don't know what it is. <laughs> this is seriously a mystery. For God's sake, just give me the damn number. Oh, Venomized Villain Spider Gwen number 24. Holy cow, that looks freaking frightening. This is the one I'm missing. <laughs> did you know about that? Maybe I did. <laughs> this is the one Spider Gwen that I'm missing that I cannot find anywhere. Well, how about that? That is so awesome. Thank you so much. That is so cool. My collection is complete. <laughs> <laughs> Finally! Oh my gosh. I've been trying for two years now to finish that collection and cannot yeah. find it with all the trade shows we go to. 
all kinds of stuff. Oh my gosh, and that is a cool cover. <laughs> I've never seen the cover, obviously. I don't know, that's freaking me out a little bit. Well, that is really how was that cool. for a surprise? That was an amazing <laughs> surprise. See, that's the kind of stuff that I don't tell her about. That way she could be surprised. <laughs> Yay! Well, Zombie JLT, thank you so much. Yes. I am so glad to finally have one of the honored zombies. I know. And I had so many goodies some in cool here. stuff in there. The rotten zombie <laughs> Skittle. Hey, was it so as much. bad as what Sega had sent you? No. Okay. <laughs> but the rest of the Skittles that I was eating was good. I'll, I'll just have to tiptoe around those, I guess. But thank you for the candies and the Funko Pop. I mean, Gambit and Rogue stuff. Yes. Oh, she's going to. I'm going to eat a Haichu. And now I'm going to pass it over to her oh. so she can try to <laughs> say her lines. <laughs> but no, seriously, thank you so much because obviously we love Gambit and Rogue. I mean, TLC intro enough, uh, but anything to do with Spider-Man and Venom and Spider-Gwen in any combination is perfect. So these are awesome. And I, I actually... I love the bobblehead. I do too. They're so much fun. <laughs> you know what's a lot of fun is getting a bunch of them and just going. <laughs> so nerdlings, please give the video a like if you happen to like it. Drop some comments down below, especially if you've been so honored as to receive a Zombox <laughs> yourself. I've seen a couple of uh, videos of those around the community and please check out that link in the description below. That'll take you to Zombie JLT. Let them know on our behalf. Thank you <laughs> so much, because this was awesome. This was really cool. And don't forget, subscribe, hit the notification bell for more zombie Do you have another Skittle blue one parts. in there? Eat another blue one. I'll, I'll try a different color one. <laughs> <laughs> I laugh if that was also zombie. <laughs> Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Tee Public because we've got merchandise over there. Hit us up on the Retro Refresh, and if we like it, we bobble for it. Bobble, bobble, bobble. Or eat candy. These high chews are good. They're dancing. Oh, oh no. Hey, it's my candy gambit. Back <laughs> off. <laughs> I'll tell everybody what you did with the mutant massacre. Oh. I know your secrets. <laughs> I'm gonna go and read some comics now. <laughs>